all on. If y'all don't start commenting and sharing and subscribing, it's going to be me and y'all. Yeah. Stop playing with me. Comment. Hello, my fault. Go to the video. Hello. Put in some of that royalty. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nick G, the host, and today I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, or share this video. You dig what I'm saying and what the goddamn hell y'all leak. So, before we even get into this, y'all, I am praying for the people that are outside with, uh, what is a Hurricane Inn or whatever. Um, pray for everybody, y'all, because it's I just seen sharks in the street. Voice got astronaut food. And Voice, what is life, straw? Y'all, just pray for everybody. Okay, um, and I just hope everybody's all right. You know what I'm saying? If you're going through it or whatever, man, get get through that. Get through that. We got to be vigilant today. I keep telling y'all. Um, also, I appreciate y'all for tuning in, man, per usual, the way you do, you know, because you don't have to. And, uh, okay, voice got everything. You hear me? <laughs> voice, you are a prepared Leo. You hear me? For those that just came to the stream, man, make sure y'all sub the goddamn hell, yeah. All right? Sub it up. Okay? Sub on up. And, um, that's about it. Let's get into it. So, B. Simone and, um, Danny Lay and the baby. Girl, I'm lost. I'm just gonna listen. So get into this. This is a whole mess. So it came out yesterday that Danny Lay had B. Simone taken off of an episode of Wild and Out that she appeared on. So basically, long story short, Danny Lay felt that B. Simone and the baby had a little thing going on and she really just didn't want to be around her. They were already beefing, okay? She already I'm not gonna lie. Danny Lay she give a lot of jealous vibes and like i just feel like you can't be jealous when you dating a nigga like the baby i mean you can't be jealous when you dating anybody that's at all but that, appreciate the follow uh taisha I, I appreciate it friend you can't be like jealous when you dating a, a superstar you know what i'm saying and from what he keep t what what from what he was saying and what is out here, sis was jealous of everybody. She had issues with B Simone. She felt like it would be uncomfortable being on the show and having to actually be around her. So as part of the stipulations for her performing and being on the show, B Simone had to go, baby. Now, just to be clear, it's only for that one episode. It is not permanently. Some people think that. Danny Lay got B. Simone kicked off the show permanently. No, she did not. But what really made things worse for Danny Lay, because people were already kind of coming down on her, is when B. Simone went on the Tamron Hall show earlier today and confirmed that this was in fact true. Take a look. There's a report that you were supposed to appear on an episode of Wild and Out, this hit MTV show, Nick Cannon show, and that another female guest persuaded producers to take you off the show. You know what, I'm gonna answer that very simply. It is true, but we're gonna have grace for that situation. Um, I don't agree with it, but I understand it, especially, you know, she's not that mature, so we're just gonna have grace. Girl, <coughs> obviously the baby done hit everybody. Megan Thee Stallion, you, you gonna go to Rolling Loud and say Megan Thee Stallion can't perform? Like, that's not how that works. Oh, it is just fuming jealousy. That's ugly. Some women can be so beautiful, but do shit that's just so ugly. Grace for her and move forward. Now, just to be shit. clear, Tamron Hall was under the impression that B. Simone was taken off the show. Now, B. Simone did reiterate that it was for that one episode, but I don't think Tamron really heard what she was saying. So she's under the impression that she was taken off the show. But all this led up to Danny Lay going live. She looked like she was getting ready to cry. She looked very frustrated with the situation. And she talks about how she seen text messages between the baby and B. Simone. So she's sure that they- Girl, you know B. Simone and the baby done already smashed. Stop playing. <laughs> like for real. You, you seen text messages for real. That's a real thing. 
Now, this is alleged. I'm just, you know, it's jokes, but come on now, y'all. I, I don't, I don't doubt. I don't doubt it at all. You know what I'm saying? Because the baby is just a thought. Yeah, he's a thought. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like he done hit a lot of women in the industry. You know what I'm saying? He just ain't calling all of them out. But girl, you won't have nobody. You you won't be able to go to no show. <laughs> you won't be able to participate in nothing. You know what I'm saying? He done hit everybody. Crazy. They had something going on, but I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys listen to her live. But after you guys listen, go ahead and leave your comments below and tell me what you think about this whole situation. And I'll talk to you later. Take a listen. Hey, okay. I didn't. My team gonna get mad at me for coming live. My heart is shaking because you're embarrassed. I'm just. I hate drama. I hate all this stuff. It's just like follows me, follows me everywhere. So I think it's just cool. I think I should just address it honestly. Cause it's eating me up and it's just really not cool um so <sighs> so the situation <laughs> my just, bottle Haley, girl that's why i took the top off I feel like <laughs> okay oh, i'm the john appreciate it was never the follow i don't know why the blogs are seeding it out to put it out that i demanded be small not to be on wild and out wasn't the case wild and out asked me i love wild and out shows I've always supported Nick. I've always supported the comedians um, on the show. So, you oh, know. This was a terrible time to speak. She all fucked up. When that voice get to trembling, boy, it'd be best that I... I, I lose my breath. <coughs> I be feel fucking mad. Or oh, hmm. anxious. I've learned now. I kind of got... I, I got I to gotta go. I got to go. Me and away Beast from my phone not cool so i just my team asked if it's cool she doesn't do the episode that i do respectfully it was never anything to be like i'm a diva i don't want i thought it'd be more mature to have us not sitting next to each other on a show making it mad awkward and uncomfortable you know like i that's i'm protecting my peace i'm protecting my heart on the situation it wasn't petty she was actually there so i'm sure she got paid it wasn't to take away money from nobody's pocket it was just, why, why would we say, I didn't know you wanted, like, I didn't know, I don't know. So, yeah. Recently, she just did a whole diss song about me. I didn't say nothing about it. I seen text messages between him and her. I didn't say nothing about it. And that's what it was. That's it. I'm handling the, the situation maturely because I feel like I'm not saying anything. <laughs> I'm just doing me and she on a tv interview talking about trying to make this a whole whatever and it just is what it is like i don't even want to talk about it i feel like i'm working really really hard right now i'm on tour i'm fucking tired i'm taking time away from my baby to like just kind of like just work and just do what i gotta do and it's just like i feel like the devil just wants to follow me and just I don't know, clown me. I don't know if it's it's real life, guys. Like, I know there's a lot of internet stuff, but you guys don't know it's real life. Real life stuff has happened. You guys don't know details. If I don't want to be around somebody, it ain't no diva thing. It's just, hey, is it cool? She's not on this episode. Oh my God, friend, you just admitted to what you just lied about. <laughs> you said that while and out acts. Did did it was it okay if she was on the show? Oh, basically, wilding out insisted to take her off the show, and you just admitted that you asked for her to be off the show. That's why she's shaking up like that, because she know her ass done. Basically, everybody like, damn, <coughs> you gonna take money out her pocket over a nigga? Like that's a, basically what everybody's saying. I don't think it was that deep. I'm sorry. Like, for real, I really wouldn't have did the episode if I would have known all of this would have came out of it. I'd rather have not done it. I just thought respectfully you definitely I would shouldn't ask did the episode. and see if that was cool. Bam. It's done. I'm, not, the follow, I'm never fighting over no community dick. I'm never fighting over nothing. Like, I'm past that. I'm over it. I understand. I'm not insecure. I'm not scared. Yeah, you I'm are. just not going to be around somebody that me and you don't clearly mess with each other so i don't know that's just it ain't 
missing out on no money. She was there. I'm sure she got paid. If she didn't get paid, well, then I should pay her for that day for her being there and her time. I don't got no more problems. I don't want to speak on the situation at all. I'm on tour. I'm working. I'm working on new music. I just want to, like, focus on that. And who knows if this will get backlash because it is what it is with me. I know everybody likes to come for me. It's all good. Like, but I'm really just focusing on myself right now. I'm on tour. And that's it. It ain't no demand. It ain't no nothing. I didn't. It just. But you did, friend. You did. You did. You really did. Child, that chocolate nigga is fucking her life (laughs) And the nerve of her to have a baby by that. My energy. That's it. That's all I got to say. So, yeah. I don't know if there's anything else I would like to say. But, yeah. I'm going to tell y'all right now. When you're going through some shit like this, reading the comments is the worst shit you could do in life. Um, I ever get put in a situation like this again, which I'm sure I will. Um... Y'all gonna see. It's gonna be real different. <sighs> Let's see what part the blogs pick up from this live and see what happens. Cause it is what it is. It's no beef. Everybody on the cast and the show, everybody was cool. It was, it was no problems on set. It was problems now, but it's all good. Like I'm not even tripping. Nobody's in my pos- nobody's in my position. What? Had- Turn them comments the fuck off. Do you hear me? Ignore. Don't see. Out of sight, out of mind is a beautiful thing. And if you got somebody in your circle that's hitting you up, telling you about everything that's going on, I've done that before too. <clears throat> but if you going through that shit, got through that shit, learn from it. I'm telling you. Nah, you won't be doing all this. Fuck that. I had a kid with John. Like, this ain't no little, it's a real, like, it was a sensitive topic for me. It was a sensitive situation. It's a lot. So... Nobody's in my shoes in this situation. So I'm so sure that a lot just of confirmed that it was about his ass. People in real life would probably do the same thing. No, friend, he is for the community. What I would have done is not accepted the show. I wouldn't have went to the show. If if I was bothered that much, first of all, I'm not gonna take money out of her pocket, you know? And I'm not about to ask for her not to be on the show because I know that's gonna backfire. This is a whole network. Of course, they love drama. They got to sell the show. <coughs> be, lo- uh, be Simone got to sell herself too. Fuck that. She lost bread for that. Now she got to get the money from somewhere else. Man, I wouldn't have went on that shit. I would let his dick belong to the community. And I'm out. Fuck all these folks. If they knew the truth, you was openly supporting me and him all the time. And then started doing you and being weird so she was kind of fucking with him before you was fucking with him i ain't gonna lie to you but I... if i do the show i should have declined yeah all right whatever <laughs> she, she about to have a fit she's such a baby she is such a baby um it was another video i seen we're gonna go ahead this three minutes oh this her live too i would ask and see damn they got a way better one <laughs> If that was cool, bam, it's done. I'm not, oh, I'm never fighting one. over no community. I'm oh, never fighting. I'm tour, I'm tired. I'm just taking time away from my baby to no, like, it's not. It's a real life angle. has happened. You guys don't know details. Same. Mess with each other. So I don't know. That's just, it ain't missing out on no money. She was, yeah, same thing. It is what it is. Hey, y'all, that's crazy. That's a total different angle. What in the hell? <coughs> Appreciate the gift subs, friend. Gifted a total of 15. Oh, you oh you gifted. Thank you, friend. Thank you so much for the gift subs. You dig? Look, I gotta keep count. That was five. Did I add? <laughs> Did I add? Oh. Did I add? And they don't fucking help me. So let me see. Cause I gotta change my number. Nah, I done lost it. That's five. Let me just add the fucking phone. Now we still on the video. 
All right, y'all, we done with this video, man. Um, Obviously, we already reacted to that part. I mean, quite frankly, <coughs> y'all know I love the baby. But one thing that I know is I will let that dick stay in the community. Because that's where it belongs. So uh, that's what she need to kind of practice on doing. And I am done with this video. Y'all let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Love y'all. I appreciate y'all. Uh-huh.